In today's tech video, I'm going to show you guys how you can turn an old iMac into an external monitor. Check it out. Before we begin, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and turn on your bell notifications so you can get notified for future videos. I'd love to have you back in the next one. Hey guys, Juan here. Thanks for stopping by my channel and checking out this video. So in today's tech video, we're talking iMacs and we're talking external monitors. Now, why would you want to take an old iMac and turn it into an external monitor? Well, for a number of reasons. Maybe you have a, a, a laptop like mine that's got a smaller screen. I've got the 13 inch MacBook Pro and it's kind of a smaller screen. So sometimes you want some more real estate, more screen real estate, a bigger screen. And so I had an old 27 inch iMac that I was able to take and convert into an external monitor and Mac has the ability to do that. Not every computer can do that, but Apple put that into their Mac computers so that you can take and uh, make a, another screen off of your laptop. So that's pretty cool that they have this capability built into their computer. So, it, But it's not for every computer. So I'm gonna show you guys which computers are capable of this function, which year of computers, and then I'm gonna show you guys the cables that you'll need, which I will link in the description down below of which ones you need and then show you the process and the steps that you need to take in order to do that. So let's go ahead and dive into this video. So I'm gonna show you guys how you guys can take an old iMac and use it as a second screen, a second monitor. But first I wanna tell you which ones that you're able to do this with because not every old iMac can be used as an external display or a target display is how Apple would call it. But these are the, I'm gonna throw them up here on the screen. These are the uh, particular models that you're able to do this with. All right, so if you're using a 27 inch iMac, you can use a late 2009 all the way through a mid 2010. Those are the 27 inch iMacs that you're able to use. If you're using a 21 and a half inch iMac, then you'll need a mid 2011 through mid 2014. Those are the models that you're able to use as far as an old iMac goes to achieve this second display. All right, so now I'm gonna give you guys the instructions on how to do this and what cables that you'll need in order to take your iMac and use it as an external display. MacBook. Uh, so right here I'm using a 13 inch uh, newer MacBook Pro. It's one of the, I think it's 2017 is what this one is. But they make these now uh, with just the USB-C ports. So you gotta live that dongle life. Apple's made it a little bit more difficult now that they only have the USB-C inputs and they don't have those old uh, HDMI imports like they used to on their older MacBook Pros. So in order to do this, you need an adapter. So what you'll need is an adapter that looks just like this. This is a Thunderbolt 3 to Thunderbolt 2 adapter. And I'll have a description or a link in the description down below where you can get this. So on one end, it's a USB-C. On the other end, it's that display port, Thunderbolt. Also, you'll need a Thunderbolt cable like this. So I went with a 0.5 meter cable. So it's kind of a short one, just because I don't like a, a lot of wires uh, being shown uh, on my desk setup. So I went with the shortest one that they offer. So those are the two components that you'll need in order to do this. All right, so the first step is you'll need to have both of your devices turned on and logged on. So I've got my MacBook Pro here on and I've got my iMac ready to go. Next up, you'll need to connect your cables. So I'm going to take my Thunderbolt cable here and I'm going to connect it to the adapter and I'm going to plug in the USB-C on one end of my MacBook Pro and take this other end here and plug it into my iMac. Let's do that now. A few moments later. Okay, so now that the cables are connected, you can see that I'm running Mojave here on my laptop, and here on the iMac I'm running an, an older operating system, but we're gonna take a mirror of this to this and make the MacBook Pro the main machine that's running. All you have to do now is hit Command F2. Okay, and now you can see both 
devices are connected together. This one's being used as an external monitor or an additional display to the MacBook Pro. And the MacBook Pro is the main machine running to both of these. So I hope this helped you out. Uh, maybe it was a little a good solution for you. If you like this video, make sure you hit thumbs up and make sure you subscribe. I do tech videos and tech reviews all the time. Thanks a lot for watching this, guys. Until next time, be creative.